welcome to Daphne's Kitchen. I hope you're doing well and still keeping safe. Oh, welcome. We are here today again to share a simple, healthy, on the run meal. Yes, Daphne's Kitchen thinks about mummies, thinks about daddies, thinks about children and everyone. So, if you're a new subscriber, oh, welcome welcome and thank you for subscribing if you're an old subscriber god continue to bless you and he will do everything you desire and if you're here to click that subscribe button oh oh yeah click it and you will enjoy every recipe that is uploaded here today we have an on the run meal or recipe i normally do this when i know the next day i'm going to have a busy day or maybe i didn't have a proper meal during the day so i need to nourish my body with some fruits and some grains and all the things bits and pieces you can think of that one needs in a day to keep going so no long talk you know what we do let's get straight to the point all right so family let's get started i've got here my jumbo rolled oat organic please try as much as possible to get the organic stuff so we are going to put them in the jar first maybe half a cup and I have here my um, full fat milk you can use skim you can use almond you can use cashew any type of milk you prefer that is totally up to you I'm going to add it as much as you can to soak the oat We're going to add a bit more milk because we are going to add some chia seeds. So you need you need enough liquid to hydrate both the oats and the chia seeds. Yes. So enough milk. That's enough. I've got here one tablespoon of chia seeds. I'm going to add that. going to give it a quick stir I have here two tablespoonful of Greek plain yogurt mm, this goodness and then I'll give it a quick stir And you know Daphne's kitchen secret. <laughs> she always goes the next step. I've got here one tablespoonful of my 100% coconut oil, cold pressed, all the way from Elinyam Foods in Ghana. I'll leave her contact below so you can contact her, or you can get your 100% organic coconut oil online cold pressed yes so i'm going to add that don't worry if it doesn't melt as soon as it gets into your tummy it only needs just a little bit of heat and and it's very good for your tummy very very good and when you're on a weight loss journey you need this read about it and you thank me later I'm going to give it a quick stir and then I have here a quarter teaspoon of cinnamon powder. I'll use just a little bit. I'm going to give it a quick, quick stir. And then I have here my Scottish honey with a one teaspoon of uh, Canadian uh, syrup. Just to give it that natural sweetness 
you can skip it you can add if you prefer sugar you can add it if you prefer just the honey you can add it whatever sweetener you prefer you can add it that's totally up to you it smells so good already don't worry if the coconut oil doesn't dissolve it will still do the job when it gets into your tummy okay we are done with our um, the base of our healthy on the go uh, do you call it snack you can call it breakfast and this can be eaten at any time so we are going to leave this in the fridge so that it can hydrate the oat as well as the chia seeds so we are going to cover this and give it some time in the fridge so after that we we'll add our toppings which are we got figs fresh figs some strawberries we've got some raspberries and then some blueberries yes so stay tuned i'll come back when this has been hydrated and then we'll do the last bit so from this we're going to check after 10 minutes this is how it looks it's still hydrating i'm going to add some strawberries and then we are going to pop in our raspberries Then some blueberries some more fruit So family, this is the outcome, our jar of goodness. Thank you all for watching. I hope you're going to try this. So I'm going to leave this to hydrate more in the fridge. So the, the base will solidify, but not too much because they are both hydrated. And I'm going to enjoy it tonight. Thank you all for watching. God bless you and I'll come your way once again with another recipe. But remember, what God cannot do does not exist. Bye-bye.